people in Washington need to know they're going to pay a political price if they don't stand up for the American people, whether that's on jobs, on foreclosure prevention, on equal access to credit. People are ready to fight. We found it easy to tap into this progressive populist sentiment and move people into the streets. But what happened this week is just the beginning. We've got to get bigger from here. Matt, you wanted to come on that? Yeah, I mean, I just, just in the issue of uh, just to show exactly where the government has been on all these issues, we could have paid off every single subprime mortgage in this country. The total amount of subprime mortgages outstanding at the beginning of this crisis was $1.4 trillion. We could have paid off every single one of those mortgages. We could have paid off every existing mortgage, uh, subprime or not, for about $12 trillion. And instead we gave, you know, roughly $18, $20 trillion to these banks so that they could recover themselves and give themselves bonuses. This was a political choice that government made to give money to one group of people and not to give money to another group of people. And people need to understand that.